We're going to change the uh, cutting blade in an electric pencil sharpener, the EDS 800 that uh, we supply. To do this job, you'll need the following tools. A Phillips number two screwdriver with a long enough shank to go the depth of that casing. We'll also require a pair of side cutters similar to this and of course a new blade. To start with remove the shavings tray and then invert the sharpener and with your Phillips screwdriver go down to the screw you'll feel it engage and loosen it completely. This one has withdrawn the screw because it has a magnetic tip but that is not essential because you can invert the machine and tip the screws out later. So that's the three. Now invert the machine again and take the cord, the mains cord, and hold it down and remove the casing in an arc like that to avoid touching any of the wiring that is in here. Having removed the case, we turn the machine over and then lay it carefully or hold it upright and there's the, the pin here which holds the cutter in. You must grip that with these side cutters as low as possible and lift the pin out. The pin can then be removed we then take the same screwdriver and remove these two screws. Then lift off this little box and rotate it 90 degrees clockwise. Then rotate this until the blade comes loose and there we have it. Reassembly is the reverse of taking it to pieces. We take the new blade and we place it in the, in the frame so that it lines up with where the pin has to go. Like so. Replace the pin with the serrated end upwards and down to the base. Hold your uh, frame firmly and two or three gentle taps. That is all it needs. Then rotate this through back through 90 degrees and place it such and replace the two smallest screws. I must stress, do not over tighten these screws as they are screwing into plastic. Having got that in, Make sure that the uh, frame rotates, turn the machine over again and we will replace the case. When we replace the case that engages over the top of the mains cable like that. It's down all around, nothing pinched and then we drop the screws in one at a time and I must stress do not over tighten them. Turn the machine up the right way and reinsert the shavings tray. <laughs> 